Hello everyone, this is Shadow Mario 41. Welcome back. Let's play Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Kong Quest. I kind of hate to cut the video right here, but I kind of had to because I was running out of time. So this is like the end of the level. If you team up right there, you can get the invincibility barrel. And then you swim really fast all the way over here to get the hero coin. Jump out and get the end of the level target. And we get Diddy flashing and playing beatbox. How about that? Not too hard, not too hard. Alright, so now we are headed to Bramble Blast, which is the first of three Bramble levels that are all known to be infamously difficult, so let's get right into it. However, I do think the Bramble stages, and I'm not alone I don't think when I'm saying this, that the Bramble stages definitely have the best music of the game, so uh, definitely worth taking a listen to. Anyway, the main thing of this stage that involves shooting these uh, shooting from barrel to barrel, repeatedly. Um, there's not really much platforming in the stage. Just a lot of timed barrel shots, really. There's a lot of hidden stuff to get to, so... Like that. So, uh, don't rule out any possibilities. I already missed the K, it was in that other segment that I kinda rushed through. So I'll at least get the O to make up for it. There is a bonus level down here. No, where's the bonus level? Okay, maybe no bonus level yet. There is one coming up. Shoot. And shoot! Oh, my bad. Hey, come on, stop. There we go. Oh, go, go. This is like a maze, kinda. Not really. No bonuses or anything around yet. Alright, here's our first one. Right there. I knew there was one, you know, hidden in one of those corners there. It was right there. Alright, let's do this. This is actually not too bad. You just have to kind of figure your way around this barrel maze. Really not too bad. As long as you go around the perimeter, I think, you're all set. Like, the middle usually won't do anything for you. Okay, let's see. This way... Uh, let's try this way. That way, and that way. Okay, we're good. And we got our 35th crime coin. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering when I actually did, uh, cut in a previous bonus, um, in a previous video, I did that afterthought of going back and getting the Red Hot Ride bonus level. I cut it, uh, right before I filmed this video, so... That's the point I was at before I, uh, decided to fill in that extra time with something that I need to do anyway. And I just failed right there. There we go. Midway point. Excellent. Get the N. Now if we are, we're quick here, we can get a free life. But you have to be fast. There we go. Can't be hesitating with your barrel shots there. Or else it'll just float away like all of my hopes and dreams. No, I'm kidding. I do love the music though. How can you not love this music? It's just so relaxing. I mean, even during a uh, pretty busy stage such as this, you have the nice relaxing music. It's just, it's just really nice. Over there was just a bunch of bananas. So if you want to go for it, that's your choice. Uh, we have to pretty much follow the bananas here to get through. So yeah, it's not that this level is that hard. It's just if you try to rush through it, you can uh, you can make some pretty easy mistakes. So, oh, my bad. There we go. Excellent. Not excellent. I'm dead. 
I was not supposed to die. Dying was not an option. Alright, let's do it again. I don't know why I moved back down. We get the end. Let's just go. We're gonna blaze through this level. There we go, free life. Makes up for our death, I guess. In the barrel. Make sure you don't roll into that guy. It's actually very easy to to want to roll into that guy because he's on these platforms and there's not much jumping room. But if you do, you'll lose a Kong, so don't. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. Now that I showed you the right way, I don't have to take my time and do all this properly. I can cheat. Cheating is the right thing to do. <laughs> Actually, it's never the right thing to do. But it can make a lot of things easy. Your friendly advice from Shadow Mario 41. Cheating makes things easier. That's terrible advice. Anyway, down here, we actually have a pretty extended secret. We have a big squawk segment here. The squawk segment actually has the hero coin and a bonus barrel, so make sure we find both. First we'll grab the hero coin since it's right here. That's 16. Watch out for the red zingers. Cannot be killed by anything, see, it just bounces right off. Jump. Grab the bananas, whoa, that was pretty bad. And we're gonna go right down here into a bonus barrel. Pretty sure this is a... Oh, this is a finding token. I thought this was to collect stars. But no, this one's actually pretty easy. Just gotta be careful, make sure you don't make any careless mistakes by flying into thorns. And you'll be all set. Gonna mash the button right there. Button mashing! Okay. Yeah, that was it. Pretty easy. And now into the level. That's where you grab the G. Also over here, you can find a hidden DK barrel, which is kind of nice. So don't miss that, and we'll grab one banana, our, our excellent prize of one banana, as we exit the stage. But hey, it's done. So I've been clearing a lot of levels with Diddy lately, huh? Oh well, let's see. We have time to fight the boss, so let's fight the boss. This is Cudgel. He is, I don't know if he's the brother of Clubba or the illegitimate son of the club's father? I don't know what it is. But, I guess that would still make him his brother, huh? Uh, but, I don't know what relation he has. Maybe he's just a palette swap. Who knows? But you pretty much just defeat him by throwing TNT into, TNT into him. And as you noticed, if you don't jump when he stops, uh, you'll get temporarily stunned. So you want to make sure you jump. And also, if you uh, hold the TNT barrel too close to him, he will swat it out of your hand. And of course, he gets progressively faster. You gotta watch out for that club swing, too. Overall, though, this boss isn't too bad. But he will get significantly harder right here. Because he doesn't jump all the way off the screen. And you do have to jump every time he lands, or else he'll be pretty screwed. He's almost dead, though. Two more hits should do it. Alright, here we go. Bring it on. A good strategy is just to have him move back and forth like this. <laughs> and not run into him. There we go. One more hit and he'll be gone. I swear you gotta be pretty quick. But, no big deal. He's dead. That was pretty easy, huh? And he lands into the swamp, and gets eaten by Snap Jaws. And Diddy Kong rocks out again, while Dixie glitch dances in the background. Yeah, Dixie, glitch dance. Alright, next we are going into Crazy Kremland. But I'm actually going to cut the video here because I want to do this on its own video. So next time on Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Conquest, we are going to start Crazy Kremland, the fourth world of the game. Ciao.